Welcome to demonstration of income expense tracker system. This application helps to track daily income expense and thus helps to manage the inflow and outflow of cash. This application also provides the income expense curve which helps to get a proper track of the income and expense. This application is developed using ASP.NET as front end and SQL Server as back end. So now let's have a look into the system. First, uh, if you are not a registered user, so just click on click here and so in order to register you have to fill the following information and uh, this is the UID that will be generated automatically by the system and if you enter a username and if uh, if that particular username already exists so it will give an error so you have to uh, enter a username which is not existing and once you're done filling the information just click on register So I've already registered. So now I'll here you need to enter the ID and password and just click on login. So once you log in, these are the options available that is add income, add expense, view income, view uh, view expense, and the income expense curve, view balance, and view other expenses. So first let's go to the add income option. First one is uh, is the transaction ID which is generated automatically by the system and this is the UID that is fetched from the database okay and here you need to enter the amount 3000 and you are the source source of income so say this. once you're done just click on submit so this particular information will be submitted in the database so the next option is add expense, uh, here the transaction ID is generated automatically by the system and the user ID will be fetched from the database. Here you need to enter the amount, expense amount, okay. Suppose uh, uh, you enter the expense amount greater than the last entered amount, say uh, 700 and just click some source of expense, okay. Uh, and once you're done just click on submit so here the what the system will do is that it will throw this message as uh, the amount that you have entered is greater than the last entered amount so the system will ask whether you want to update the expense amount so as soon as you click on submit this particular information will be submitted to the database next option is view income so here you can uh, view the information of income that is the transaction ID, user ID, amount and the source of income and the date. That is the date on which you entered the income amount. Okay. So, uh, so the system also allows you to search the income depending on the month and year entered. Okay. And the same goes for expense. Here you can uh, view the information about the expenses the daily expense okay next option is income expense curve here you just need to enter the year and the month of okay so for example I entered 12 so as soon as you select the month the system will give you a curve a proper chart of the income expense of this particular month and year so the next option is view balance here you need to enter the month and year and the year once you're done just click on search so what the system will do is it you will be able to view the total income the total expense and the savings and the date and if you want to set the expense limit you can do over here so suppose I don't want to update it the expense limit and and if you want to transfer some amount from the savings to other for other use then you can enter over here So once you're done just click on done over here and this information will be submitted in the database. So the next option is view other expenses. Here uh, you can view other expenses. For example I've selected birthday and uh, as soon as you, uh, you select this thing uh, the system will give you the amount available and if you want to withdraw some amount from this you can do over here. Okay. Once you're done just click on submit and that particular amount will be deducted 
सो दिस इज हाउ द सिस्टम इनकम एक्सपेंस ट्रैक का वर्क थैंक यू